Hello, fat fans. Welcome to BC Word. Well, James Tony, <laughs> you know, got asked about uh, Big Baby Miller, the guy Joshua would be going in against on June 1st. So, ES News asked him what are his thoughts, you know, about Miller. Well, he's a, he's, a, he's, a, he's a cool guy, he's a cool dude, but he does not buy into the hype of Miller being this huge, dangerous guy that people seem to want to make him. <laughs> you know, <clears throat> we know ES News is a real fanboy, and uh, a real fanboy of water and all the fathers as well. You know, I don't think he liked Joshua. I think he got uh, some stick from Fast and Fury, you know, at some point during the Water Fury uh, fight. And he tried to actually hype Jeremy Miller up, you know, to James Tony. I just only told him who has he fought. <laughs> I love in Chinese, well. <laughs> well, I'm loving it. That is very funny, you know. James Tony, a legend. You know, one thing I like about James Tony is that this guy always keeps things real. I mean, what we guys see, what we all see as huge stuff or huge guy, or, man, James Tony don't see that. This guy's fought everyone you can imagine. You know, he's competed in four weight classes, you know what I mean? And has had. World Championship belts, titles, you know, in three different weight classes. Man, you've got to give this guy props. You know, he's a legend, a legend, you know, a real legend, you know. And Jim Stone's record is, he's not to be, not, 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 not to be messed or joked with because he's got a very good record. So the question is, who has Jeremy Miller really fought? To deserve this hype, you know, he's getting from all these fanboys. That's because they want to see Joshua lose, okay? You know, that's just the fact. I mean, all these guys, I mean, I like ES News, the guy, but I just think he's too much of a fanboy. You know, of the fanboy, you know, fathers, you know. And uh, when you're too much of a fanboy like that, you kind of lose the reputation, you know what I mean? So, Jeremy Miller hasn't fought no one, I mean. He's fought no one, man. We've got to, we've got to say it. I know, I know just was fighting him next. But, he's fought no one yet. You know, no one of notice here. Like uh, his first fight was against Darius Whitson. Second fight against Isaac Villanueva. Who's this guy? I don't know. Third fight against Donny Crawford. Fourth fight against Tyron Gibson. <clears throat> Fifth fight against Joey Davieco. Sixth fight against Tobias Rice. Seventh fight against Willie Shinzom. Eighth fight against Sylvester Baron. Ninth fight against John Hill. Tenth fight against Joshua Harris. Man, all those guys is fought. Roderick Carey, Aaron Cage, Raymond O'Sheeng. Raymond O'Sheeng? For real, the same guy Apoche stopped. <laughs> Apoche stopped Raymond O'Sheeng, uh, you know, in his last fight. You know, stopped him brutally. Then Damo McCreel, S.A. Holmes... Akfov Muramilov, Donovan Denis, Nick Gib Givas, Fred Cassie. The same Fred Cassie that actually got knocked out by Izu Gunner not long ago. I mean, let's keep it real. <laughs> then Gerard Washington. Well, we've already know what happened with this guy. Washington got stuck by water. <clears throat> Marius Wag. Marius Wag is a very good uh, good win for Jeremy Miller. 
uh, Bill Maraswak uh, was already past it, you know. You want Duwapas, you know, the same guy, the underwater stopped, but Melia couldn't, couldn't stop the guy, you know. Oh, you want Duwapas gave Miller hell in that fight, you know. Actually exposed Miller a little bit, you know. I mean, I'm not saying Miller is not a good fighter, you know, he's a very good fighter, I think so. He's a big guy, you know. 300 something plus pounds, you know, he can actually box, he can fight, he, he can do all that, he has a good engine, you know, he throws a lot of punches, you know, for a big guy that, that, that big, for a guy that big, he throws a lot of punches, but he has not really fought the caliber of fighters that Joshua has faced, I mean, just look at Joshua's career, unblemished, bro, unblemished, you know what I mean, so, Joshua deserves all the credit and the hype he gets, you know, from certain people who know about boxing, but other people don't want to give him the recognition or the credit because they feel like when once they give him the credit, they then discard themselves, you know, you know, it's just like a little bit of jealousy if you add to it. You know, guys like even Olafid, who is a legend in the sport of boxing. You know, talking shit. Uh, there was Lewis as well. All the, all the, all the legends. But James Tony keeps things real. I mean, let's keep it real. Joshua is fighting Miller Ness, we know. I actually did not want to see that fight. But after what Miller, you know, did and insulted his mom and all those stuff, I felt like Miller needed some ass whooping from I think Joshua and on June 1st he's gonna get it by the way a team member of BBC will actually be there live on the red and hopefully get to interview the unified everywhere king of the whole universe I wish I could be there but I can't because I got things to do and uh, yeah that's it for now guys uh, give it a toss below or like the video share and please don't forget to subscribe to the channel guys go follow me on instagram at boxing block center and as well on twitter at boxing block cheers